Hi everyone, welcome to Watch It Played. My name is Rodney Smith. If you're like me, you might have a few games in your collection that you really enjoy, but some of the components included leave a little bit to be desired. They could benefit from some upgrades. For example, in my copy of Dice Town, I replaced the paper money with poker chips. And in my copy of Lords of Waterdeep, I replaced the cubes with these custom laser cut adventurers. And I don't think I'm alone in saying that these small changes can really bring me into the theme of the game more and increase my enjoyment when I'm playing. And a lot of games, especially those with resources, come with these bland cubes. Well, Look out, resource games, because you're in for a major upgrade. I want to introduce you to the Stonemeyer Games treasure chest. Let's go to the table and I'll give you a closer look at what's inside. In this chest, you will find a variety of premium quality resource replacements. There's 26 of each of the six different types, and the video will not do justice to the quality of the production here. But let me get some of these out and I'll give it my best shot. These are the gold pieces. I wish you could hold these in your hand because these aren't just pieces of plastic that have been painted gold. These have actual weight to them. When you feel them in your hand, they're heavy. Listen to them on the table. So these actually feel like pretty significant resources and they represent gold. So that's the way they should feel. And look at the textures on these brick pieces. They have irregularities. They got the holes that you'd expect. They look like bricks. And here's the wood pieces. And again, the texture on these looks like the bark you'd find on a log of wood. Here's your metal and stone pieces. And I think these are made from different materials. This is a little bit harder to get across on screen, but when I hold them in my hand, tap them together and just feel them, there's, there's some kind of difference here. Certainly they look different. The metal pieces have more texture. They have a shine to them. The stone pieces are a little duller and they have a smoother look to them. Well, no question about what these are. These are your shiny, light-reflecting gemstones. A nice blue and rich color. Stonemeyer Games, the makers of Euphoria, Viticulture, and this treasure chest are known for many things, but certainly one of those things is the quality of their productions. And I can assure you they maintain that tradition here. So we have several different resources that can be used interchangeably with a variety of different games. Now, you might be wondering, do I have any games in my collection that I could use these with? There is a list on BoardGameGeek that will provide you with several suggested games. I'll put a link to that in the description of this video. I'll also put a link to the pre-order page on the Stonemeyer website for the treasure chest. Those pre-orders will ship out in January of 2015. Also, Jamie Stegmeyer of Stonemeyer Games told me that for every pre-order that happens during the week that this video initially releases, he will put $5 of each order towards a charity of my choosing. This is not an additional $5 that he's going to charge you. He's going to take that $5 from the profits he would otherwise be collecting. I have to say, that just that's very impressive. And uh, thank you, Jamie, for that offer. I'd like to choose a, a local children's hospital for those donations. So please do check out the website. See if this is something that you would like. But until the next episode, thanks for watching.